What is up, crafters? Today, I'm going to be showing you how to apply a resource pack to your Minecraft server. So maybe you have a resource pack you really like and you want to force your players to use it or you're too cheap to buy a plugin like Items Adder or Aroxin. So I'm just going to show you how to set up that resource pack, but we're going to see if we can do it in under three minutes. So make sure to subscribe if you think I can do it and even subscribe if you don't think I can do it. All right, let's go. So first thing you need to do is actually get your resource pack. If you don't have one yet, I'll link a couple websites in the description. But for this video, I'll be using this dumb resource pack. Next, you want to head on over to mcpacks.net, more like MC Hacks, and drag your resource pack over choose file. Now just click the upload button and wait for it to upload. Then you'll want to copy the download URL. Now just head over to your server's file manager and look for the server.properties file. Go into this file and look for a resource pack. Paste the download URL after the equal sign. Go back to MC packs and now copy the SHA1. This basically makes it so players don't have to download the resource pack every single time that they join. At least I think. So head back into your server.properties and paste the SHA1 after the resource pack SHA1. You can also make it so players are required to accept your resource pack by setting require resource pack to true. You can even set a message for when players are prompted to download the resource pack. Just make sure to surround it in a apostrophes. Now just click save or the keyboard shortcut control S and restart your server. Once your server is back up, let's go ahead and join. So as we see here, we get our little prompt message that we set and when we decline the pack, then we get kicked from the server. So this is because we have require resource pack set to true. Okay, there we go. Now we have our resource pack. A couple other things I should mention. So MC packs limits your pack size to 95 megabytes. Now this should be more than enough in almost every situation. But if you need more size than that, then you can upload your pack to something like Dropbox. And also, if you want to apply a resource pack to Bedrock players joining through the Geyser MC plugin, all you have to do is upload a .mc pack into the packs folder of your geyser install folder and then just restart your server. Well, hopefully that was under three minutes, but thank you so much for watching this video. If this didn't work for you or just having trouble setting it up, then you can feel free to pop in my Discord server and I can try to help you there. Otherwise, you can check out both of my Minecraft servers. We have resource packs on them. But until next time, I will see you on the other side and happy crafting.